If you guys would like to go ahead and purchase a cheap and instant GTA 5 modded account for Xbox One, PlayStation 4, and PC, then make sure you guys do check the link in the description of this video. What up guys, it's Helpful Gamer here and today I'll be coming at you with a brand new GTA 5 Online glitch video where I'll be showing you guys my top 5 best working glitches working after patch 1.37. So if you guys do go on and enjoy today's video, be sure to comment, like, and subscribe to show your support towards my channel and it shows me that you guys enjoy my content. So yeah, if you don't want to miss any more daily GTA 5 Online glitch videos, be sure to turn on notifications. But hope you enjoyed the video and let's get in to the glitches. Okay guys, for the first glitch, what you guys want to do is you want to head over to the location shown on screen and make sure you have a friend with you to help you with this glitch because you're going to need somebody to hit you. So once you guys are here and you're on this little rooftop area, all you want to do is run in between these two poles and take cover and then from there just have your friend keep hitting you. When you fall over from your friend hitting you, you want to tell him to run towards you and try to like keep your body in place. So my friend wasn't doing it the right the first time, so I just skipped past all the fails. It took us about like five tries. But as you guys can see, he knocks me over, run towards my body, and then I teleport right into the glitch area. And it's like a really easy glitch, guys. The only downside to this glitch, you actually can't shoot out of it. There's some areas you could shoot out of, but like all the easy access spots that you won't fall if you try to walk there, you can't really shoot out of it. But I think it's still a pretty cool glitch because you could just hide out here, use it for a whole bunch of different things, maybe like take a thumbnail in here if you do videos and just stuff like that. And you could shoot people when they're trying to climb into the glitch. So yeah, it, it could be used for a whole bunch of different things. But yeah, let's get on to the second glitch. Okay guys, for the second glitch, I'll be showing you how to get in the back of the gargle bob. Some of you may know this, some of you may not know it. For the ones who don't know it, here's what you do. So you wanna head over to the location that I just shown on screen. So once you guys are here, all you wanna do is have a friend with a cargo bob or just bring a cargo bob here anyway and make sure your friend has a cargo bob parked exactly like that. Make sure the opening by the ladder is lined up with the back and the tires are on the metal right there. Once you have it like that, you guys just wanna drive around to the, um, to the ladder because if you hop off that bridge, you'll just die. Once you guys get here, you just want to simply walk up the stairs as you see me doing. And then you guys just want to climb up into the helicopter. Once you guys get in the helicopter, you want to make sure your friend does not start flying. Just tell him to stay still. And then you want to jump to the back part. This is the only part you could stand on when he's in the air. But from here, what you could have your friend do is fly in the air. As you guys can see, you could actually shoot out of this like I'm shooting flares out of it. So this, this is actually a pretty awesome glitch in my opinion because you could shoot people while your friend is flying and you could shoot people out the back. You actually can't shoot explosives because if you shoot RPG, you'll blow up, but you could shoot bullets out of this at the right angles and stuff. So it's a pretty dope glitch. But yeah, that's it for the second glitch. Let's get on to the third glitch. Okay guys, for the third glitch, I'll be showing you guys this dope god mode wall breach. So all you guys want to do for this glitch is head over to the location shown on screen. You also want to make sure you have a friend. Well, no, you don't You don't need a friend for this. I'm just using my friend to kill him for the video. But you just want to get on top of this building. And then you want to come like over to the edge, like where I'm at. And you want to walk on the edge of the building right here once you're at the top. And you just want to like stand right here and then try to fall into the wall. So don't do what I do and just hop up there. You want to just like try to roll into the wall. If you don't do it the right way, you'll fall off the building and die. But as you can see, I just kind of like drop in there. It's not that hard to do, but if you don't get it right, you'll fall off the building. But yeah, it's basically that easy. From here, what you want to do is go into first person. And as you guys can see, my friend is right there on the helicopter and I'm shooting him. So you actually can shoot people through this glitch and they cannot shoot you. I'm not sure if RPGs will kill you but i know you could shoot explosives out of this glitch also as you guys can see i tested a rpg right there so i don't die 
and yeah it's, it's just a really easy god mode wall breach that could be used for a whole bunch of different things and since it's solo you can use it to like troll people or like escape people and stuff like that sorry for the notification squad but yeah it's basically it for the third glitch this dope god mode wall breach that could be used for a whole bunch of different things trolling hiding whatever but yeah let's get on to the fourth glitch Okay guys, for the fourth glitch, I'll be showing you guys the only invisible arm glitch that actually sticks. You could do this glitch and you will still have the invisible arms after you leave the CEO or any mission. It's a legit invisible arms glitch. So all you guys want to do for this glitch is make sure you have a cop outfit. Once you have the cop outfit, you just want to head over to any clothing store and go to overcoat blazers and go to no top. And it's that simple. You will have invisible arms and they will stick. If you guys um, don't want to lose the cop belt, then don't do this glitch because as you can see, my cop belt disappeared. And if you don't already have the cop outfit to do this glitch, I'll leave a link in the description to one of my cop outfit videos. I'll just leave a link and I'll start off where I'm doing the cop outfit glitch. But yeah, that's it for the fourth glitch. Let's get on to the fifth and final glitch. Okay guys, for the fifth glitch, I'll be showing you guys how to get in the back of the cargo bob now some of you may know this some of you may not know this for the ones who do not know this glitch here you guys go because i always want to support the people who haven't seen all of the glitches but anyways you want to just head over to the airport get a cargo i mean like get a titan not a cargo bob and then when you go into the titan you want to have your friend hit you don't have him hit you when you're walking out have him hit you when you're walking in and make sure he's standing on the side i am or it won't work so as you guys can see, my friend hits me from the left side, and then I drop right there, like I drop right in. So make sure your friend is standing where my friend was standing, so he could hit you into the right part of it, so you'll glitch in and stay in. From here, you guys could just do whatever you want, take some Rockstar Editor moments. You could get as many people as you want in here, as long as there's one person hitting everybody inside of it. You could get at least probably 20 people, like, packed in here. But yeah, it's a really awesome glitch, guys just a unique glitch that i felt like putting in today's video it hasn't been uploaded in a really long time so i figured some of you may not know this who are new to glitches but yeah hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you did enjoy today's video be sure to comment like and subscribe to show your support toward the channel and it shows me that you guys enjoyed this video but yeah let's try to go for 15 likes on today's video that would be amazing guys but once again this is helpful gamer signing out Peace.